hey guys welcome back to my channel let's get ready so here's all the makeup I'm going to be using today and we're going to start with the NYX brow glue this stuff is amazing it holds your brows down and they won't go nowhere then we have the L'Oreal 24 hour infallible foundation and I'm using just a damp beauty blender and I put about three pumps and I'm putting that all over my face and bring it down on the neck to blend now I'm using the makeup eraser from Maybelline for contour and I'm just blending that out and of course I put it on my forehead as well and then I'm gonna blend that out as well with a damp beauty blender I use different ones for contour and different ones for concealer and different for foundation so that way they don't mix and kind of cover each other up then we're gonna go in with the pretty fresh from ColourPop concealer and I basically apply it on the like bridge slash inside of my eyes and then underneath my entire <laughs> my entire eye and then I take another damp beauty sponge and I blend that out I also bring it onto the um, sides of my forehead there then I'm taking the hydrating contour trio from Almar cosmetics and I use that as my under eye powder I also use it as my bronzing powder this stuff is amazing and so I just let it sit and then I brush it away now we're taking the half caked your eyes only eyeshadow palette and look how pretty it is to create our eyeshadow look for today so we're gonna start with the first shade which is the lightest nude in the palette so we went in with disc space now we're going in with buffering which is the second lightest nude we're just putting that on the outer edge of the eye basically on the outer V of the eye and then we're running in circular motions to blend that in and also some swiping motions above the eye now we're going in with AO technology and we're just putting that on the outer corner and then blending it so this eye look is mostly about blending so we're continuing to blend now we're gonna go in with the Lower East Side City Chic palette um, it's just a four pan tiny little palette it's great to put in your purse and I'm just gonna take a angled brush and mix the two darker brown shades to create like a faux cat eye eyeliner and then I just brushed it away and now I'm blending that so as you can see I'm just taking the shades and I am creating the like instead of using like a liquid liner I'm doing it with the eyeshadow with an angle brush and then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna blend that out and then I just take a big fluffy brush and wipe away the fallout under the bottom and we're gonna keep repeating the same process till I get the same effect on both sides then I put a little bit on my waterline there just to make it more smoky now we're gonna go in with the Girlactic long wear gel eyeliner in the shade brown and we're gonna tight line our eye and then line the top of our eye as well and then we're going to take an angled brush and we're going to blend it out so it's more smooth.
Now we're going to take the Araceli Ojos Perfectos Gel Eyeliner Pencil, pencil in the shade Olive. And I'm just going to use that in my waterline. Now we're taking the Voluminous Lash Paradise um, Eyelash Primer in the shade Millennial Pink. This stuff really works wonders. And I'm just going to fully coat my lashes until they are all pinkish white. And then I'm going to let that dry before I apply any mascara. So while I'm letting it dry, I'm going to go ahead and finish the rest of my face powder, which will be my blush, my uh, bronzer, and my highlight. So now I'm going to take the darkest shade and the Milani Luminoso blush, and as well as the Ofra highlighter in the shade Rodeo Drive, and apply that all over my face, where you would normally put bronzer, blush, and highlight. And look at this highlight it is just beautiful and amazing and reflects so much light and it's not chunky at all then we're gonna take the essence lash princess mascara and the look is completely finished went ahead and did my brows off camera but as you can see it is all done thank you guys so much for watching